Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. I'm Lennon. How are you guys doing? Welcome to the new year. Happy 2023. By the time this is being uploaded, it's the new year. So, uh, like you've seen in the update video, my new year's resolutions, uh, I wanted to start another campaign for the Wednesdays. So this is going to be a once a week kind of thing. Maybe with a little bit of gap in between somewhere if I have something, a different video that I think is uh, worth it to be uploaded in that spot. But as you guys can probably see from the title and the thumbnail, welcome to my piece de resistance, my beginning in Total War history. Welcome to Rome Total War, in this case the remastered version of course, but welcome back. Um, I am excited to play. It's been a very long time. The last time I opened this game was, I believe, April 2021. So I'm going to be a rusty AF, but we don't care about that. I'm going to take you guys with me into the game and we're just going to see how it goes. Um, I am planning to challenge myself quite a bit in this campaign. So um, don't be really surprised if I mess things up. Uh, <laughs> And we lose the campaign in the first like 50 turns. Um, I wouldn't be surprised. It's probably going to be a lot of defense on the way in. And offense on the way out. So let's transition into the game. And I'll tell you guys the plan. So here we are in the selection screen. Um, I thought maybe you could play as Rome. But like we're already doing that with the Parabellum. And we're already Bactria. And... Uh, we finished 1100 AD here in the north of Britain, so I thought, why not challenge myself to a Seleucid playthrough? And the reason for that is they have a nice, like, mix of troops with like the hoplites, swordsmen, elephants, archers. They have everything that you need to be a badass conqueror. And also they have in Rome two we have the MLG Freeman. Here we have the MLG Militia Hoplites. And I'll show you guys that probably in the first five turns. But we're playing on hard, hard difficulty, which is probably gonna be torture for me. Um, realistic governors, yeah. Uh, bum, bum, bum. Let's do no battle time limit, see how far that goes. For case, just in case something bugs, I'm gonna leave this on, by the way. Uh, we're gonna do a long campaign, just for shits and giggles and we're gonna follow our characters so that is the way we start the campaign and the cutscenes are back the I really love world. this one Alexander did he took a Greek army to the far Indus there was nothing left to conquer the world was his but Alexander is dead his empire is gone this brings me back, man. So we live in evil days. The three men of Greece have turned on each other instead of their proper enemies. Those who envy all the Greeks have done. Alexander must weep if the dead weep. I would weep in his place, but I would also hope. The world turns. What was may come, come again. again. The fates still spin the web of men's lives. The gods wish Greeks to be great again. Perhaps a new Alexander will take up the soul. Bring order where there is chaos. Remake the world of men to a better plan. Perhaps. Perhaps. Like, I, I so enjoy these cutscenes. Like, I almost memorized... And there was a time where I almost memorized all of the... Julii intro. Gods. I hate Gauls. Like that first iconic sentence is wow. And just the voice lines and the, the, the things, the energy they put in into this game, for its time, it was a beauty. It was an absolute beauty. So we're just gonna keep this campaign like we normally do. So hopefully I'm gonna see if I can get these parts between 20 and 30 minutes. Um, if there is a battle which is like insanely long, I might cut the episode. 
for the battle so we have a little bit shorter episode and then a long battle episode or the other way around and it might just happen that if a battle is like that insanely big that I'll cut the battle into two parts and make it two episodes but see if we can get a little bit of a cliffhanger here and there to keep to get you guys keep coming back but yeah it's uh, it's good to be back I've had a mod for Rogue 2 so long with this music I don't believe it still works but I really enjoyed this and that is the end of the loading screen okay guys so you have to give me a little bit of time to get readjusted to the settlements um, how everything works Ooh. okay it's a little bit buggy but um, oh yeah I just have to get a little bit familiar again with how everything is going. Um, our diplomat is gonna go this way. Oh, he's gonna go all the way over the top. Is, he, is there a crossing over here right now? There wasn't, right? But there is. So I would probably want to have you go yes. over that way. Okay. Alerts, news, reports. Okay. Uh, cash money is over here. We get plus ooh, 5k per turn. Um, we should probably see if we can get Helicarnasses. Where is our army? This is a fleet. Okay. Do we have a standing army somewhere? Sir. Where is our standing army? My our spy is over here. Um, let's get you this way. I don't think we have an actual standing army. So we should probably recruit something over here. What can we construct? Oh, mines. Yes. There goes literally all of my money. And these are militia hoplites. Okay, that is almost everything I can do for one turn. Public order, alt, click to open wiki. Okay, that doesn't seem to really work. Do have a decent size garrison over here. Damascus, we have a decent size garrison. Antioch, which... Uh, where do I see the city details? Garrison, happiness, squalor. So let's start by at least making some shrines. Great light weapons, happiness. Public order bonus plus 5%, happiness, population growth. Okay, that is one. Oh, let's get you a palisade. That might be handy. And that is, I think, all of the money I can get. Slukia. Oh, Slukia has a decent sized army. My lord! But I do think I would want to have at least something over here as well. And the only thing I can build here are peasants. Probably get yes, one of you to go Onward! that way. And My Lord. militia calf that way. So we have decent sized garrisons everywhere. I know this is a little bit of a long turn. Um, fleets, agents, armies. Okay. 
that is, I think, everything we can do for now. Like, it's really weird that I don't have to deal with, like, uh, politics and diplomacy. I just really need to get this guy going over here first. Um, let's start recruiting some more here. Uh, you're still building. You probably should get Ooh, mines as well. First, get a palisade, please. You already can get a stone wall. This gets us levy pikes. This gets us already elephants and Greek calf. Holy moly. Cactus range, trader. Shipwright, plant clearance, roads. Okay, since we're not at war right now, let's see if we can get some land clear, uh, get a trader going. Uh, you should get a barracks. You should get a wall, probably. But also get a barracks, because I know Parthia and the rebels are gonna be not amused by us over here. Okay, um, troops wise, let's build over here, let's build one over here. And this is all just peasants, I guess. Let's build another Peltist unit over here. Oh, here we're already building. Okay, I believe that's everything we can do for now. Our spy is on the move, our diplomat is on the move. Okay, that is the fastest. Okay, Palmyra, also a valid target right now. War dead! My lord, moving into position. Ooh, Dillon Warriors, East Nifty, Archers, okay. What can you spare? Probably not that much. And we still have very decent income that is okay this gives me actually gives me quite a bit of time to start building up some stuff um let's get these tables It'll cost four turns quite a bit of money let's get a trader here and let's get that one later unit wise you're still building we only can build one a turn that's the most annoying part because like there's a five stack over here and there's a two stack in jail so we need at least a ten what are you uh what are you oh we have merchants ah i forgot about that one why are you going that way go over here Do we get the market? Okay, I think that is everything you are building. You are building. Everybody is building and is everybody recruiting? You are not recruit recruiting. Oh, there's already there's already a spy in here from Parthia. Okay. <laughs> That's gonna go well. You can hold. Atra, not so much. Antioch should probably be recruiting. Everybody's recruiting. Okay. Okay, this is gonna be a little bit of Greedy. the first chill episode. Um, there offers trade rights map information. Our yes. Thing. That is perfectly okay. We are done. Suitable husband. Uh, yes, let's do that. So we have a general to put an army in. And where did you go? From Katnajo. Oh, over here. Okay. So you will become my first army. 
Yes, so I'm gonna get yes, are you guys in there. Forward. March. And then yes, Stratigos. These three guys in there as well. So that is then a eight stack. Oh, nice. We can have mercs. Sir, my lord. Uh, just gonna put you guys in there as well. Antioch, you can build everything you want. Um, let's see if we can start getting a merchant as well. Sewers. Yeah, man, we have good cash on hand. I thought this was gonna be very hard from the start, but apparently they're just waiting for us to feel confident and then they're gonna kick us in the teeth. Land clearance for growth. Uh, should we go... Probably should go walls, because Slukia is a valid target for Parthia, I know that much. Um, let's get a diplomat first. So we can at least try to talk to Parthia. Marriage celebrations. Yeah, I don't know. What, what do you want to do? Do you want to go explore? Uh, let's go this way. That is Macedon, okay. Ready! Uh, that is a rebel army, which we probably need to deal with very soon. So our first targets are gonna be Halicarnassus and Palmyra. For the rest, defense. And my spy is my lord Over here. yes master do we want to go down towards see what Egypt is doing hmm. oh Parthia is already here okay greetings Trade rise map information. Our yeah, thanks. it won't be any long time before you start killing me. Greetings. Our sure. thanks. As well, let's do that. So we have a decent map information right now. Uh, Parthia, Seleucids, Macedon's over here, Greeks, Pontus, Armenia. Okay. We can deal Sir. with this. Let's get you March. over there. Yes, my lord. Forward. Yes, Stratagon. That is a ten stack. That Rebel should be Rebel. able to easily take Homera. That is a rebel. Antioch is still building the market. You ain't building jack shit. Let's get those mines we wanted and recruiting wise we can't do anything you are building and doing okay great let's put the life clearance in there as well i feel there should be a lot more like aggressiveness in this first episode but uh, maybe we can deal with this. Orders. My lord, sir. Yes, yes. Strategy. Orders. Victory. Praise Ares. Prepare for battle. Oh, we can already fight a night battle. Just, just for shits and giggles, let's have one little battle to please get into it a little bit. This, these loading screens. I was hoping they would be faster due to this game being older and not so much resource intensive, but 
Oh, Victory actually, that's not too bad. Is near at hand. Default, await my orders. Militia, hoplites. Um, let me see. Formation. Group. That unit to lose. Stand in formation. Form a phalanx. Okay, this is gonna be very annoying. This pike formation. Hoplite militia. Hoplite. Units. Double. Unit. Units. You're both in pike formation. Units. Double die. Hey, didn't I take my general with me? Cavalry. Oh, okay. Can run as well. And then what what did they have? Horse archers and peasants. Okay, those horse archers probably gonna be the most annoying. And you guys don't fire. And off skirmish mode. We're probably just gonna have to push, they won't come to us. Divide infantry, missile calf. I wanna see if I can get some horse archers for myself as well. Let's see if we can get to here before we start walking again. Memo. Units. Units. No, that's probably not going to end well for you guys. They're attacking us. Okay, what the fuck are you guys doing? Yeah, they're not gonna let me come into range. That is the most annoying part. It would be better for your general to fall on his sword than live another day. He is running away! I thought Mr. Cav would have a little bit more backbone, but... Okay, I already know horse archers are gonna be the fucking bane of my existence. Okay, that went worse than I expected. <laughs> okay, my units are 
I forgot this was room one. Holy moly. <laughs> I barely lost in like three units. Like in room two, those hoplites would have just easily massacred them. But ladies and gentlemen, as we are entering the end loading screen, I want to end the first episode here, so I want to thank you guys for watching, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, please smash the like button down below, comment if you think we're doing the right thing here, or if you have any other suggestions, please let me know as well. I really love some feedback from you guys, and subscribe to the channel as well, there should be a thingy down in the bottom, and over there should... over there <laughs> should be a video for you if you choose to watch it so thank you guys for watching hopefully you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys next time peace